Hi right, guys, so I'm in my studio and I had a bunch of friends in the entertainment community here in Vegas. They were wanting to know how to live stream and they only have their phones and they have a little, they have a little mixing board. I have this little mixing board over here like this. Uh, There's just a little, uh, uh, what, I don't know, eight channel uh, with effects on it. Also, it's a USB sound card too, but even if you did, whatever you, mixing board you have, as long as you have your, your uh, stereo outs, you know, if you have effects, great. If not, whatever. If you have enough channels for your vocal mic, which I believe he has wireless. I don't have a regular mic in there, so if you see a wireless, you can use any mic. Just as long as you have a, a channel for your mic and the guitar or however many channels you need, you have a good enough mixer. And then the only other thing you need is your phone, of course. And if your phone, of course, like mine, I have to have this little adapter to get uh, headphones in there so I'm sure your phone came with it so you need that but what you're gonna need is you can't just plug your mixing board right into this thing into this input because this is a I gotta pull this up here this is a TRRS input which means basically there's three let me get this out of my way so you can see okay which basically means there's three rings on that which that's a TRRS. And what you need to plug your mixing board in is a TRS. So in that case, you need this little adapter right here, which is a TRS, which is this, which is your input, which, which so you'd plug your mixer into. And um, which is like a little cord like this, basically with two quarter inches on there and a little uh, eighth inch, you know, or headphone jack on that side. And this one, of course, it has the, TRS, which is just the two, let's see if you can get that, the two lines, like a regular headphone jack. I don't know if you can see that or not. Yeah, anyhow, that's a, that's a TRS, and you need to convert that TRS to a TRRS, which is a, let me see if you can get that in focus. Hold on, sorry. Three line. Okay, so three line will go to your phone. Basically, you take your iPhone, or my, like my case, I have a Plus One, and you plug your little adapter that comes with it, uh, you know, from the, the USB-C, so it goes in there. If you already have a headphone jack, then all you need is this, um, and you can plug this right into your headphone jack, because your headphone jack into your phone is a TRRS, and so we're gonna plug that TRRS and into your phone. And, hold on. And then we're gonna plug, and this is now, this is converted to a TRS. And I'll have the description of this little wire in the, on, to Amazon, that was like 12.95 for that little adapter. And these cords, I'll have, I'll have a link to a cord like this, you know, in there too, uh, in case you don't have one. Most people have these for at home anyhow. Anyhow, then just take this over, and now you're all set. Now, um, one thing about is most phones, their, their onboard camera won't record onto this. You have to download a special camera from the App Store where you can select your sound card. But Facebook, I just tested it, and you can live stream it to Facebook, no problem. It'll, 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 it'll automatically read the sound card from your board, the sound coming from your board when you have this hooked up. And uh, there's no real way to mix it on Facebook, so what I would suggest is, which I just did, and I didn't have that on video, is I went private. Uh, on my own, so only I could see it, and I got the audio to where it sounded good on Facebook. Now I know when I go back, it's not going to sound amazing, but it'll sound all right, but I'm just showing you guys. You can play with it as long as you want and get it to sound really good. But right now, it's not distorted. It sounds clear. Uh, might be a little hot, but you know, you just have to kind of play with that and just go back and forth um, on Facebook, just testing. Just test the audio privately, and then after you get the audio you want, then you know the audio sounds good and go live. Now, with your board, let me come back over to my board. You know, like you can also, like when we stream live, we have, uh, we have an in-ear body pack, you know, in, uh, but you don't have to go that drastic. I mean, you can even just plug headphones in if you want to monitor yourself. But after you know your mon after you know if you're, uh, like these, you know, headphones, headphone jack, uh, after you know you already have a good sound and you don't need monitor, then just don't worry about it. But um, I'm just that kind of guy where I wanna hear my guitar and uh, stuff while Alicia is singing. So the other thing you might need is this little handy dandy adapter. You can get these cheap off eBay for like two bucks or off Amazon for I don't know how much, but basically all they are is a little clamp with a little screw in the back. 
So you can, pick, you can just hook up your phone, on, clamp on your phone like that, make sure you don't put it on your volume knob. <laughs> and now you can mount that on a tripod, like say this one, if I can find the end to it. You know, like this mic stand I picked off offer up for like 15 bucks. Then you just screw this thing on to your cheap mic stand, or, uh, cheap camera stand. And I'm actually gonna live stream to Facebook for you right now. I'm gonna have the camera out there and then after this video goes up, I'll put the link to that live stream. You guys can check out my horrible rendition of Every Rose Has Its Thorn uh, just for your, but you can kind of see how the audio, remember I didn't spend a lot of time on the audio because I have a lot of things I gotta do today. So I'm just kind of, you know, doing this so I can show my friends who need to figure it out. So basically get your phone on, you know, turn your phone on and kind of figure out where you want to be at. You know, if you want to shoot this way, shoot this way. If you want to shoot, you know, the long ways, you can, you know, turn your tripod, you know, basically like this and bring your phone up. And then you just take this end. You have your, you have your phone plugged in, your adapter plugged in, the long cable plugged in. You can go over and plug this end into your cameras. Uh, just uh, quarter inch outputs right there, right and left. And that way, if you have reverb and stuff on your board, you know, the reverb will of course go on Facebook and, uh, and you'll be good to go. So now I'm going to bring this over here so I can see myself. I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna get this lined up. Okay. Facebook is going to make me rotate it. Oh. All right, so let's try that again on Facebook. All right, I am live and I am doing a tutorial video. You guys can't see the other cameras, but there are, there are two other cameras that are doing a tutorial video for Drew, because Drew was wanting to know how to, how to live stream through his phone and get better audio. So this is what this thing's about. So if you're watching, Drew, this is for you, because um, you know, so I did, I, the, whole, the whole tutorial on how I did this, and, uh, and we're gonna test the audio after I do the live stream, is going to be up on YouTube after I get this done. And then uh, after I get this done, you'll actually know how to run from, your, uh, from, from any cheap mixing board into your phone to pick up your mic and your guitar. All right, so this is for Drew, because Drew was wanting to know how to get better audio. So you guys watching, you get to see me sing Every Rose Has Its Thorn. <laughs> Here we go. Ready, Drew? See, you hear the reverb? Check, check, check. Reverb's going into the phone. I have the headphones on. You don't have to have the headphones on. I use, we use in-ears when we're actually playing. Hey, guys. <laughs> Here we go. This, this is the tutorial video for Drew, by the way. The video is going to be on YouTube after we're done with this. So here we go. It rose has its dawn Just like every night has its dawn just like every cowboy seems a sad, sad song And every rose has its thorn Yeah, it does. Anyhow, we're going to test that audio now, Drew, and see if this worked. So anyhow, if it did work, then the whole tutorial on how I did it will be on YouTube after I get done with this. And I want to I really appreciate all of you guys who are watching me make a fool of myself for Drew Anthony. So when Drew Anthony watches this, please, everyone, instead of wave at him, flip him off. <laughs> all right? So you guys, wait, now listen, hey, we have a fatal again coming up in like two weeks. We're going to be live. We have a bunch of cool guests, and it's going to be more music, so check it out. All right? All right, we'll see you guys later. All right, guys, so I just finished my live test live stream on YouTube and now we're going to uh, on Facebook my test live stream on Facebook so we're gonna check out the audio and see how it sounds you won't be able to hear it but I'll leave a link in the description so you can check it out remember I didn't spend that much time if you're gonna when you do this you want to go through and just private your live stream 
and get your audio dialed in uh, because no way of really monitoring it this way. Uh, but it took me like two times to get it dialed in and good enough to make sure that the gain wasn't too loud or it wasn't distorting. If it's distorting, just bring your gain down on your on your um, channels, you know, your, on your mic channel and your guitar channel until it doesn't distort anymore on Facebook. And then you'll know you're good and just start live streaming. All right. Thank you guys for watching. Hope that helps. Hey guys, it's Victor. And it's Alicia from Fans of Jimmy Century. Can you guys do us a mondo favor and go over and subscribe to our YouTube channel at youtube.com forward slash FOJC TV? We'll tell you why later. Later! later.